All right, guys, we're in gear. I'm gonna start this video right now by saying thank you for either clicking that link or thank you for coming here from one of my social media platforms. I'm sorry about the little buzzing over here. I gotta get out of here, man. This car alarm keeps going off. It's crazy. But anyways, guys, if you made it here from one of my social media platforms, I thank you for that. Uh, thank you for following my accounts. Thank you for staying up to date with what I post. And if you if you did not make it here from one of those accounts, I would like for you to go ahead and follow me on those accounts. I've got a Facebook, a Twitter, an Instagram. All of those are going to be at Will Gallahue. Those are in the beginning of my video, so if you didn't catch them there, uh, just go back. You'll see it there. But anyways, guys, the topic of today's video... And before I get started, let me let me move from this car because it's getting really annoying. But if you guys can read this. The topic of today's video is this gonna show up. So that is what I'm gonna be talking about today. Essentially, you are gonna die, and the question I have is, what are you gonna do about it? Are you gonna sit around and whine and complain and? act like you have nothing okay maybe, maybe you do have nothing maybe, maybe you don't have anything okay maybe you're watching this video and you're feeling like crap and you just don't know what to do with your life well guess what guys I've got some news for you uh, I've been there too and so has probably most of the rest of the world so you're not alone there and I have some more good news for you you are the only one that's going to be able to decide your own fate. No one else is going to do it for you. Your mom's not going to come around and say, all right, come on, let's go. She's not going to hold your hand the whole way through it. You are going to be the only one who ultimately decides your fate. So now I know talking about this kind of stuff can be kind of touchy for some people, but I apologize if, if you're finding this to be a bit like a, a smack in the face, but that's okay. Because I'm, I'm here to talk to the kind of people who are able to understand this from where I'm trying to come from. So, I've been watching a lot of uh, Gary Vaynerchuk videos lately. And one of the things that he has been talking about recently in one of his little videos he made was uh, he had people coming up to him and asking him for inspiration. And he literally said, you're going to die. And the person looked back at him like, what? Why would you say that? And well, if you think about it. All of us, at some point, are going to die. I know that sounds crazy to think about, but if you can, if you can think of it as, okay, if you can be real with yourself and put some things into perspective, everyone at some point is going to die. Old, young, accident, old age, bad health, whatever. It's gonna happen. So, what are you gonna do with your life knowing that that's going to happen at some point. Are you going to sit around and always whine and complain? Or are you going to go out and, and make something of your life? Because ultimately, there is going to become, there is going to be a day where you can't do anything anymore. And when that day comes, wouldn't you like to be able to look back and and gaze upon all of the awesome things that you've either built or that you've accomplished or that you've done for people or whatever, whatever it may be. Uh, I know a lot of people, I actually, I've helped out at, at nursing homes and stuff like that and I think one of the biggest things that I hear people talking about, and not even at a nursing home, just people in, in you know, in everyday life is, it's regretting, it's regretting things and that, that to me is, is a very, very bad thing to have. Now, I'm not saying, like, go get freaking... I'm not saying, like, go get no regrets tatted on your face and stuff like that. That's not what I'm talking about. I'm just saying that at the end of the day, all of us have a limited amount of time. And what you choose to do with that time is upon you. Ultimately, you choose your fate. So, my advice to you would be sit down and think about what it is that you want to accomplish with your life 
what it is that you want to accomplish. It's that easy. And take it day by day with your notebook, writing down every step. It's that easy, guys. It really is. The thing that separates winners and losers is that winners get real with themselves and they go out and they execute and losers sit around whining and complaining and they never actually do anything to better themselves or to work towards any kind of goal. So I just want you all to take take this video, allow it to give you that push to go do something with your day, with your life. Because, like I said guys, something that we all have in common is time. And some of us have more, and some of us have less. But all of us have the ultimate decision to choose our own fate. So with that being said guys, I know this is a quick video. Who knows, maybe you guys will like that better since most of my videos have been like 10 minutes and up. I'm gonna end. I'm gonna end the uh, end the video with that. I thank you for watching. Comment, like, share, and subscribe. Follow me on my social media accounts so you guys can stay tuned for when I post new videos like this. I thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.